I think you need to hear a little story about when these two were dating. Or as I like to call it, when Mary met Sally. <laughs> What are you doing in the closet? I could ask the same of you. <laughs> what? Who are you? Oh, how quickly they forget. We met at Matt Stokes' party, my card. <laughs> Jack McFarland, since 1969. <laughs> what are you even doing here? Aren't you in high school? Well, I prefer the college parties because the fellas tend to be less uptight about their homosexuality. <laughs> Oh, yeah, now I remember you. You were the one going around telling everybody you were in Duran Duran. Oh, that's right, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and, and you think everybody's gay? No, not everybody, just me and you and a dog named Boo. <laughs> hey, hey, huh. I'm not gay. Well, this well-worn copy of the Dreamgirl soundtrack begs to differ. <laughs> What are you doing here? Nothing. Well, you shouldn't be here. You know, we're gonna, we're gonna get in trouble. Not if we're quiet. But if you play your cards right, I might not be. What are you suggesting? <laughs> well, you, me, a bed. Huh. I thought that we might. Oh, <laughs> don't make me say it. <laughs> Grace, I don't know. Oh, come on. Uh, what are we waiting for? Well, I just, I'm, I, I'm kind of tired, you know? That, that all the turkey, it made me sleepy. Really? Because it made me horny. <laughs> My bones! The studio. Hi, Jack. It's it's uh, it's Will Truman. Oh, right, from Queens College. <laughs> no, I go to Columbia. <laughs> Missy, anywhere you go, it's Queens College. <laughs> yeah, you know what? That uh, that's why I called. You know what you said really bugged me. I am not gay. about me, because if you did know me, you would know that I am not gay. Oh, yeah, now I get it. <clears throat> You're in stage three. You've bought the short shorts, but you're afraid to put them on. <laughs> yeah. Put them on, Will. Come on, put them on. Dude, stop, stop saying that, okay? I am not... Abs you're gay, Will, okay? You're gayer than the day is long. <laughs> you're Marvin Gay. <laughs> and let me tell you something. Ain't no closet big enough. This is ludicrous. I mean, we, we, we spent all four minutes together. Yeah, and in the first four seconds, I could tell that you were carrying the weight of the world on your shoulders. And about 20 extra pounds in your hips. <laughs> Why wouldn't you? It's a drag pretending to be something you're not. If I'm pretending, then how come I can't wait to get back in there and have sex with my girlfriend? Well, if you can't wait to get back in there and make muskrat love to your girlfriend, then why are you on the phone with me? Yeah, that's what I thought. You're my new best friend. Call me every five minutes. <laughs> oh. Wait. No! Yeah. Why? Are we ready? This is a really big step, and I, I just, I don't want to, I, I want it to be right. I don't want to rush into it. Oh, my it. God. Are you, you are. What, what? I mean, I sort of suspected it. I mean, it certainly would explain a oh, lot. Oh, no, no, oh, no, no. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. It's okay. You don't have to feel bad. My dad was one all through the army. <laughs> what? <laughs> You're a virgin. Virgin? Yes. Yeah. Oh, no, oh, no. No, 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 no. I'm definitely not a virgin. In fact, uh, 
I've been known to be something of a lady man. Ladies man, ladies man. <laughs> man! <laughs> yeah. Well, well then why are we waiting? Because. But why? Because I love you. Oh my God. You are so sweet. It's so like you to say it first. <laughs> I love you too. Mm -hmm. Okay, I have to have you right now. Whoa, 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 wait, 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 hold on, hold on. Did, did you hear me? I, I, I love you. Yeah, yeah, I love you too. Let's go. Mm -hmm. What? Right. Oh, just. God! I, I think. What? We really, really should wait. Oh, but why? I mean, what are we doing? Are we, are we waiting till we're married? Yes. <laughs> Let's get married. What? Let's get married and let's wait till we get married. <laughs> you want to get married? <gasps> oh my God! <laughs> well, <laughs> yes, I will marry you, Will Truman. <laughs> <laughs> when we get married, I'm not only gonna take your name, I'm gonna take your family too. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe we're actually going to do this. Yeah. Look, um, I don't really know how to tell you this, so I'm just, I'm just going to tell you. Uh, um, you know, before when I said I, I loved you, I really, really meant that. I do love you. You know, you, you're the best. I, I, I can't imagine my life without you. Well, now you never have to worry about that. Yeah, well, actually, I... I'm feeling a little lightheaded. Um, you see, there's this one teensy little complication. Actually, not so teensy. I. Are you I'm hungry? Gay. What? what? Are you I'm hungry? gay. What? what? Exactly the reaction I was expecting. Oh my God. You killed me. <laughs> oh my God. Grace, I. Oh my God. Grace, I. Oh my God. Grace. When did you? We're getting married. Yeah, you know I don't think I can go through with that either. On some level, I've always known. You know, I mean, the guy toweling himself off in the Zest commercial always did a little too much for me. <laughs> oh, great. Great. The Zest guy knew before me. No, no, no. That's, that's not what I'm saying. It's, I, I, I don't think I really knew for sure until we were in bed together, you know? And I, I took one look at you and your, your sexy underwear, and I just went, whoa, I am gay. <laughs> You know, I mean, you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, I think I do. Yeah. Just, just one thing. What are you doing? What are you doing? You bastard! I'm in love with you, and you're treating me like some sort of test drive. You take me up for a spin, and you go, hmm. I don't really like the feel of this one. I think I'd rather have a stick. <laughs> Don't you see what a compliment that is? I mean, I mean, I love you. So if I can't make it work with you, then, then it'll never work with any woman because you're perfect for me. That is not a compliment. A compliment is you're sexy. You turn me on. That one look at you proves I'm a queer. <laughs> I understand that you're upset, but I mean, this is a this is a very big step for me. You know, how about a little support here? Well, you probably would have gotten a lot more support from me if you hadn't asked me to marry you first. Okay, in in hindsight, not a good move. Oh, hindsight? Is that like one of your gay words? <laughs> what? <laughs> Look, I never meant to hurt you, but it's not like. 
I planned to be gay. I heard yelling. Is everything okay? What's going on? Nothing. Will's gay. Oh, sweetie. Oh. Julius, I owe you 20 bucks. Oh, my God. Will's gay. Grace, you ruin everything. <laughs> How could I not have known? He was Boy George for Halloween. <laughs> he has a diffuser on his blow dryer. <laughs> and he's prettier than me. <laughs> must be so hard for you. It is. I knew you'd understand. Oh. For a guy to do that to you, it's humiliating. I would die. I would, I would just die. <laughs> you must not feel sexual. <laughs> or pretty. <laughs> I mean, there's that gnawing question. God, did I turn him gay? I mean, am I so gross? Okay, I'll... <laughs> I get that you get it. Think you'll ever talk to Will again? Oh, no way. People already think I'm weird because of my haircut. <laughs> you add a gay friend to that, I might as well be a drama major. 